Sigma Surgical has been formed in uh, 1998 by Mr. Jayanti Koti, is my father. Uh, there were an incidents, uh, that incidents is uh, things to inspire my father to enter in this industry. He was used to manufacture the diamond polishing machines. And his, one of his uh, friends came to him with some kind of uh, mechanical solutions where they are facing an issue and to deliver the medical device or uh, some specific products in uh, uh, low cost profile things. So my father came with some solutions and the ratio previously were uh, somewhat more than 50% was a rejection ratio which was managed less than in 2% by my father's picture and uh, his friend uh, uh, told him that why don't you come in the medical device industry and this is how we started to think about the, this industry yeah so this is just about uh, somewhere 1988-89 and uh, after that he started to work for some of the indian companies and then he ventured with his younger brother mr gopal Goti and came up with uh, sigma surgical private limited this is how we enter in this industry uh, he started with some of uh, five or six people in 1998 and nowadays we are working with some of uh, 310 people in this facility. Uh, we are the largest trauma implant manufacturer in this industry in India. Globally we are working in more than 23 countries. Major customers are from Europe. Uh, apparently we are also working in uh, Southeast Asian countries, we are working in the Latin American countries, some of the Gulf countries. This is our uh, global presence right now. Uh, in uh, medical device, we are just uh, doing trauma implants only. We are not uh, having multiple branches of uh, medical devices. This is the uh, things made us uh, more precise to deliver the products in this category. We are the only player in India who is uh, delivering supporting instruments, which is also made in India. Major peoples are uh, importing the things from Germany or China or some of the supporting countries. But we are the only manufacturer who is also delivering uh, instruments also made in India. So this is the biggest things for us. And uh, the soft floor, what we are operating with is almost almost one acre of the carpet area. So which is the largest in India in medical device manufacturing. And uh, we have more than 600 different SKUs in uh, trauma products. Uh, gradually, we are adding uh, at least 10 or 12 uh, new products each year. So this is the things we are uh, uh, delivering the products to the market. And uh, Sigma is doing the turnover somewhat, somewhat uh, 60, 62 CR uh, in present year. Uh, out of that, uh, almost 48% uh, stake is from the global market and rest is the domestic market. Uh, in medical device industry, especially the part from implant manufacturing, and it's come to the trauma implant manufacturing, so major things are uh, complex surfaces that are there. To have that uh, things uh, manufactured is required more precise machinery. And to manage that kind of machinery, we should have more precise software or more uh, featured software. This is how we came to the having the kind of uh, special software like Topsolid. If I'm talking about trauma implant manufacturing, there are two ways to manufacture this component. One is we can cut it from the solid. We can cut it from the solid. This is a simple uh, manufacturing process. And second one is we can do the forging and then uh, do the semi-finished machining, then come to the finished machining. This is how we manufacture this product. So in uh, our requirement, uh, especially we are from India and we are delivering the product to the Indian market. So product price is always a uh, major constraint there. Uh, so to having a forged component and the, from the semi-finished machining, then ma finished machining is a little bit uh, economic idea or a more cheaper idea to have the product uh, very quickly and in uh, uh, commercial terms it should be very economic, right? To manage that things and at the same time we need to manage uh, uh, product accuracy because we are in the medical field it's a life saving product so product accuracy is a big task over there to manage this kind of uh, complex things we should have a good fixturing system we should have a good forging mechanic systems there and that is how we are looking at the kind of software we can 
manage the kind of complex surfacing and all these things. Okay, so uh, apart from design, Topsolid is the fourth software what we are operating with. And apart from the CAM, it's the third software we are operating with. Uh, we came to the advanced machine, like uh, Mazak machines were there. Uh, that was the first uh, brand we have associated with for the uh, multi-axis machining. In that era, the top slot 6 was there. And uh, the machine was a little bit complicated to have a perfect output over there. And uh, the only top slot was uh, the software was able to deliver our demands. And that's how we started to work with top solid. And we are, I think, operating last 13 years since last 13 years with the top solid. Like surfacing is most the things we require, the complex uh, uh, fixtures and zigs are required there. Apart from design, the top solid is a software where we can ask anything to the software and we have an answer. Yes. That is why we are very happy with the top solid. Uh, apart from the service, uh, top solid India team is, uh, I think, uh, tremendous. Whatever the questions are there, they are having their answer. They are uh, having the solutions for us there. That is why we are pretty happy with them. But earlier we were using some different software. So that software are mainly to cater the dye mold industry, not for the specific uh, product manufacturing in medical device right now we're doing. Uh, after having the top solid in our hand, uh, we reduce almost almost 14 to 18% of the cycle time by having the good tool path. That is the biggest advantage for us to go with the top solid. Uh, apart from design, it is very integrated software. So the reverse engineering is there or uh, some kind of revisions are there in the product. We are having a very good command with that things. So we have a design changes and we have a good uh, tool path within a seconds. That is the biggest advantage to have uh, saving the time what we need to have between the different version of the product. That is also the biggest advantage with the top survey. Okay, I should say that yes, uh, saving the idle time, especially the tool idle time is the biggest challenge in all the uh, products and industries. This is the biggest saving time. As I said that 14, more than 14% time we are saving there. So we are procuring the less machines. So of course the revenue is there. That is what we are saving. Apart from uh, component rejection, yes, we have a good machines, uh, we have a good uh, software and uh, good integration. For an example, uh, the top solid is delivering uh, tool libraries and uh, uh, primary uh, uh, job preparations are there. So the interchanging time between the different component, the well-documented uh, things are coming out from the top solid. And so we are saving the job setup interchanging time, which is again the uh, revenue loss. We are uh, having a good uh, impact over there. I wanted to add one thing that time was 60 minutes to 75 minutes previously, which is right now less than 30 minutes. It's more than 60% actually. Uh, we are having a three license for design and the two license for CAM. In CAM, uh, we are uh, having a turning modules are there. We are having a Pyxis machining modules are there. We have multitasking there. So we are using the same software for multitasking uh, machines also. We are having the boost milling is there, which is again the time saving for the fixtures and all these things. So these are the license we are operating with top solid. Uh, right now, uh, we are targeting a double R turnover by coming next two years. So for that, uh, we are planning to strengthen our R&D team, our, uh, production managing team and the, the key person between R&D and the production is the CAD CAM system. So right now we are having uh, five engines are there. We are planning to have at least eight engines by end of the 2025. So we are adding more four or five license over. Well, uh, productivity is in two different parts. One is the developing the product in the soft scenario and second one is the production cycles. Uh, looking at the software, it is quite easy software. Uh, the people who can use uh, Word or Excel, they can use the top solid design. This is how simple it is. So it's very less uh, time wastage to train the people. Uh, we can have our design team to ready to operate with top solid within two or three days. So we, we are able to aid the people very quickly in this part. And about the manufacturing cycle, uh, the tools like a boost milling, 
um, it is giving a tremendous cycle time saving uh, giving a better tool life is there because of the tool path is quite smooth like that so of course it's not directly but indirect uh, cost saving like uh, longer tool life or uh, more engaged spindle with the machine so this is how it's a good tool it's a good experience i must say uh, i recommended more than 10 people in my group my colleagues where i offered blindly go with top solace something like that uh, apart from me uh, i personally know more than uh, six or seven design software i masterized there and out of that six softwares uh, top solid is much 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 better software to cater the dimol industry or medical industry that is why i can suggest top solid blindly to them okay so right now uh, we are the second largest uh, implant manufacturer in terms of the revenue we are the largest trauma implant manufacturer in terms of the product numbers. Uh, we have a, a five years roadmap. There, uh, we are planning to become the top 10 people globally in the trauma implant manufacturing. So uh, the production team is almost almost 310 people are there. We'll have at least 525 people by end of the 2025. And uh, right now we are operating with some of the 42 machines. We are planning to have 75 machines are there. Uh, parallelly, uh, we are planning to have, uh, as I said, more than eight design or cam teams over there. And uh, planning to have a first R&D center in medical device in India. So that is what, uh, as an Indian manufacturer, we are lacking. But yes, we are having that, that kind of plan to have it. So uh, if I am talking about the data safety, uh, we are in the medical device uh, manufacturing industry. When we develop the product, we need to keep some uh, personalized data from the surgeons and from the patient also. So we also have our own uh, security systems out there. Uh, top solid CRP is absolutely submerged with that. So you won't see any difference that you are operating the standard system or you are operating some kind of the server control system so people will not identify a kind of uh, uh, restrictions over there it's it's moving flawless right but out of that uh, it's encrypted data so no one can copy and uh, have the access to there that is the biggest advantage with uh, uh, top solid erp system it is a good to have these things kind uh, we have our own uh, uh, security systems which is keeping the data in cloud in multiple inscription and uh, uh, the same file will be divided in multiple locations. So the integration of the top solid with that kind of system is very good. So in my industry, uh, the biggest challenge is uh, batch sizes. We, we can't have a longer batch sizes like a 5 days batch size or 10 days, no it's not like that. Our uh, longer batch size is somewhat like a two days batch, somewhat 500 component or 600 component. After that, we need to change this component. Uh, unfortunately, we have a different kind of machine like Mazak, which is 3 plus 2 machine, second Mazak, which is continuous 5 axis, uh, third one is DMG machine, which is a continuous 5 axis but the different kind of the kinematics. We have a Chiron machine, is there, uh, Makino, which is again the HMC 5 axis. So, the the entire workshop is having a different philosophy of the machines. In top solid, we just change the machine model and uh, we regenerate the tool path and it's ready to cut the job. It is just like this. It is doing a great job with having a kind of tool, especially the simplicity in this tool is very good. Uh, we are operating a multi-axis machine with there. Uh, our major part is the sliding gate machines. So we are, we will be very happy if the top solar is coming with the solutions for the sliding gate, especially for the tall mass machine and citizen machines and the Sugami machines are there. So right now we are plan we are just doing R&D with the top solar India team. But yes, we had a good uh, experience on the DMG sprint machine with them, which is again we are very happy to have that kind of things, and we are planning to extend it there. And I hope that Top Solid will come with the uh, uh, solutions that uh, meet endless demands of the machine manufacturers like me. Thank you Top Solid to have the kind of tool in our hand. <laughs>